Hey guys, y'all ready for a little red update? I am. Uh, got the spindle modification done. I've decided to stick with the gas pedal issue that I was having. I decided it's not an issue after all. I've decided I like the way it is. I don't really use the dash throttle anymore, so I've now pretty much just foot throttle for a little red. So let's get to the modifications. <laughs> As you can see there, I made uh, new spindles to lower the front end a little red, as you can see here, get it in there. The nose would be way up here, well, let's zoom out some. The nose would have been right about here before, at the tip of my finger, so now it's down there. But anyway. You can see my new spindles. They seem to be beefy so far. I've popped some willies, several willies in fact. Uh, got both sides. I don't know if you can see it, but there is a slight tilt in at the top. I believe that's negative camber on that one. And this one. I did that on purpose. I was thinking maybe when I'm turning, I did, the outside tire would bite just a little harder. And boy, it doesn't. So, still need to finish my exhaust. Sounds sweet right now, though. But uh, there it is. New update on the front end. Got the nylock locking nuts. There's a no play whatsoever you know, for wobbling that. But only issue I ran into is I had to trim this little corner off here after I shortened the bumper from about right here. So I knocked off two inches and then I put in a little slice there and now it clears even when i'm uh, turning and i've got full uh suspension throw going on so no more bumping that uh, bumper luckily i checked that before i went riding on it so uh i didn't get all get things all twisted up but anyway there's a quick little update on little red loving the spindles Loving the new front ride height. The seat feels so much better.
and that's a wrap.